Seafood lovers, thank you for watching another episode here at Bart's Fishtails and today we're going to make a cut and a crumb. And this crumb consists of all kinds of Asian ingredients. It's quick to make, it's easy to make and actually you only need an oven and a little pan. Okay, so we start making this recipe by making the crumb. And we will add the crumb on top of the fish. We have some beautiful cod right here. And the crumb will be based on butter. To this butter, we're going to add all kinds of beautiful ingredients. One clove of garlic. And it's really important making the crumb that you really chop it fine, fine, fine. You, want, you don't want to have these big pieces of garlic or chili, next ingredient, into your mouth. It should be really balanced. Okay, next one is a chili. I'm using half a chili, cut it lengthwise, and then chop it fine. Next one, lemongrass. Cut it lengthwise, using half a lemongrass, and cut it fine. Next one is ginger. Two slices like this, making small cubes again. And it's a nice balance. We have a bit of, well, the kick of the garlic, bit of spiciness of the chili and we get this typical flavor of lemongrass and then we have ginger. Next one, coriander. Chop it fine. So actually now it's time to make the crumb. I have a little saucepan. I have it on medium to high heat. So I'm using around 35-40 gram of butter. I'm going to melt the butter and then I'm going to add the garlic and the chili. I'll add the garlic the chili and I add a drop of sesame oil okay so I've added the garlic I've added the chili and I will add the lemongrass and, the ginger. and I add the coriander and to finish it off a bit of lime zest and here I've got the panko Japanese bread crumb. so this took me four minutes crumb is ready, I've got the fish here, make sure that the fish is really dry and I'll add the crumb, look at the color, look at this, it's beautiful, you have the white fish and you have the crumb with all these beautiful colors. I have it in the oven, in a preheated oven of 180 degrees Celsius for around 6 till 9 minutes. Beautiful. See the golden brown, the crispiness. Have it on the plate. I add a few drizzle, a few drops of butter, the infused butter, and I finally slice some spring onion. A bit of molten sea salt. Caught with a crumb. Actually, you can use any fish for this crumb, especially white fish, um, with some infused butter and lime. perfect combination this fresh juicy fish together with this crusty crumb full of flavors of all these beautiful Asian ingredients give it a touch of lime and your dish will be perfect thank you for watching if you have any comments any questions leave them down in the box below please don't forget to subscribe and hope to see you soon back on another fishy Friday